Today I will explain about decimal to binary conversion. How can I uh, convert decimal numbers to binary numbers? By using repeated division by two methods, we can convert easily any decimal number to uh, binary. The method said to get the binary number for a given decimal number, divide the decimal number by 2 until the equation is 0. Remainders for the binary number. For example, for converting the decimal number 12 to binary, according to this method. Now, at first we will start to divide 12 by 2. 12 divided by 2, which is equal to 6, and the remainder is 0. Remainder, we mean baqi al qasma. Now, if the quotient is 0, no, it's 6. So, we will continue until the quotient, it will be 0. Now, 6 divided by 2 is equal to 3. There is remainder, no, so it's 0. Now, the quotient, it's not 0. It's a 3, so we will continue. 3 divided by 2 equal to 1. There is remainder? Yes, the remainder is 1. Now, is the quotient is 0? No, it's 1. Now, we should continue. Now, 1 divided by 2, it is 0, but the remainder is 1. So, don't forget to divide the 1. The exam all years uh, students they do mistake by uh, stopping here so don't stop just uh, when the question is zero now here uh, we will stop okay now 12 12 in decimal equal to from where I should start to write? From here or from here? I will write 1, 1, 0, 0 or 0, 0, 1, 1. Which, which one is correct? So we will start from least significant bit. And we have most significant bit. This significant bit, that means the smaller one in position. So it, this it will be. Uh, the least significant bit. Why? Because it's 2 to the power 0. And this is 2 to the power 1, 2 to the power 2, 2 to the power 3. So this one is correct. Okay? And this is not correct. So 12 in decimal equal to 0, 0, 1, 1 in binary. Let's go uh, for another example. For example, 19. I will solve uh, one of them. Uh, you can solve 45. So 19 divided by 2 equal to 9. Is there is remainder? Yes, remainder is 1. Again, 9 divided by 2 equal to 4. Remainder is 1. Now, 4 divided by 2 equal to 2. The remainder is 0. Now, again, 2 divided by 2 equal to 1. Remainder is zero. Now don't stop. Okay. Uh, every year there is uh, some students they stop uh, here, so the result would be not correct. So be careful. Now one divided by two equal to zero, and the remainder is one. Now this is least significant bit, and this is most significant bit. 
So the result here is 19 in decimal equal to, we'll start from here, 1, 1, 0, 0, uh, 1. And binary. How can I check my result if it is correct or not? It's one one zero zero one. It's correct or not? Let's convert this binary number to decimal. Suppose you don't know what's the result. How so? How can I convert binary number to decimal uh, according to the or uh, the position? So uh, this is two to power zero and 2 to power 1, 2 to power 2, 2 to power 3, and 2 to power 4. Okay, 1 multiplied by 2 to power 0, which is 1, plus, this is uh, 2 to power 1 multiplied by 1, which is 2, plus, this is this is 0, 0, so no need to write it, or I would like later. And finally, 2 to power 4 multiplied by 1, which is 16. Now, 16 plus 2 plus 1, which is equal to 19. So, my... Uh, Result is correct. I'll try to solve uh, 45 by using the same method, and you have a related problem convert decimal number uh, 39 to binary. Now, if we have fractional part and decimal number, how we can convert a fractional decimal number with fractional part to a binary? Decimal fraction can be converted to binary by repeated multiplication by 2. For example, to convert this number to binary, we will repeat uh, multiply by 2 until the fractional part reach to 0. Now, let's start 3, 1, 2, 5, multiplied by 2. 2 multiplied by 5, which is 10, so 0. You one. Now, 2 multiplied by 2 is 4, and there is carry 1 will be 5. 2 multiplied by 1 is 2, and 2 multiplied by 3 is 6, and the, uh, this is the fractional part. Now, if there is carry, no, it's 0. So, this 0, it will go for carry, and this fractional part, again, we will multiply it by 2, until the fractional part it will go to zero. Now two multiplied by five it is zero carry one. So it's ten zero carry one. Two multiplied by two four and carry one it will be five. Two multiplied by six it's twelve. So we have carry part. We will take the carry and the fractional part again we will multiply it by two. Just the fractional part. Now, 25 multiplied by 2 is equal to 50. The, there is no carry. And 50 multiplied by 2 equal to 10. So, the carry is 1. And all the fractional part, is, uh, all zeros, now we can stop. So, how can I write the result? Oh, point three one two. This is a decimal equal to. So we'll start from here zero, one, zero, one. There is okay. Finally. Try to solve this example, but uh, 
don't use this one. Use converting each decimal number to binary by using the repeated division by two and the repeat multiplication by two. So here we need uh, two methods because we have a fractional part and try to solve this one also. It's very important, this one and this one, to understand the subject.